The question regarding genetics and the occurrence of visual snow popped out of the survey in quite some detail. Uh, though it was not the dominant feature, it did show a, a commonality of a family relationship and particularly along the, f the female side of the family going back generations. Uh, so it appears that visual snow is affected by the uh, mitochondrial DNA of the mothers and also known as MT DNA. But that seems to be an area that's really worth uh, further research as we obtain more records of a family that might have uh, visual snow. As far as any ongoing research in that area, I'm not aware of any, but uh, I haven't done a real survey in the last three months or so of the literature. Uh, it's worthy of doing, uh, but the DNA uh, studies around the country are so, well, around the world are so broad that I'm not sure anyone has tried to focus on a VS component at this stage of the game. What we can do is further research uh, is I think just answered. We really need a DNA samples from a family of at least three generations that can be examined for a common uh, error, if you will, leading to VS. It may not be a simple uh, short code. It may be in some of the, what are coming to be called activators that uh, might affect puberty as well as visual snow.